Empire within 24 hours, I'll blow your planet away! <laughs> the battle has just begun! Hello. <laughs> Welcome to week two of Pika. Season two. Battle. <laughs> my, my opponent is staying late at work so we can use a computer to battle me. I've been waiting all day for this guy, all week actually. Um, and I'm just beginning to have uh, some second, second thoughts on, on my uh, team. Because, uh, yeah, of course. Yeah, let's get cold feet right before I have to battle. Uh, he's the Denver Dashers. Uh, he's got Low Punny, Mega, Keldeo, Suicune, Dragalge, Tangrowth, Regiorock, Rotom, uh, Tornadus T, Reuniclus, Zoroark, and Typhlosion. Now, I am really concerned about Keldeo because I ran the Calcs just now. And Specs Keldeo kills Gastrodon uh, pretty fucking hard. Uh, so that is not great for me. Because I don't have, like, I have a couple fighting resists, sure. Uh, in in Lati, Latias and, uh, and Sylveon. But once they're gone, uh, I'm going to have uh, a big fucking problem. <laughs> um so it really just comes down to whether he's a uh, scarfed or specs or maybe he, he's neither maybe it'll be life orb or sub call mind or something weird i know in his uh, first week match he used a uh, fucking extreme speed tailwind suicune just for shits and uh, he won anyway he <laughs> he fought the guy who rage quit and left so he wasn't really that good his opponent was jackson jump Luffs over here which, by the way, um, we're on week two. Two people have already abandoned ship um, and are no longer in the league. Um, it's uh, sad to say a tie of the Atlanta Braviaries hightailed it after having an emotional meltdown with his match. And uh, let's see, Jackson Jumpluffs, uh, aka Pokepiece, just became completely unresponsive. So this thing is going to shit real fast. And I don't know what to do with some of my teammates. For some reason, uh, I think Gastrodon is a good idea, but I'm looking at it now and he doesn't really do much for me other than um, Wall Suicune and arguably Keldeo. Like, if Keldeo picks Secret Sword and I have, pff, I have like no fighting resist at all, um, I'm gonna be, <laughs> uh, up shit creek, so, whoops, I was already there, I was already there. Need to look at my own team here, fuck this, a little bit, um, get, get the fuck out of here, timer, timer bullshit. Uh, here I am, what could I possibly bring? Uh, Electivire, actually, Electivire is... Pretty cool. Um, yeah, actually, uh, I was looking at Electivire earlier, but for some reason I settled on Gastrodon. Um, although the only way to use <laughs> Electivire, <laughs> the only way to use Electivire is uh, to get a free switch and be scarfed because he's not going to do shit. Actually, I did calc Electivire earlier and uh, he's not going to Oko um, Suicune even with a choice band and that is just disgusting. Uh, so maybe I won't use Electivire for this one. Um, who else then? Maybe Machamp? What does Machamp do for me here? Um, he, if he's Assault Vest, he can take, um, he can take on some people. Uh, yeah, I just really need, um, I don't know, dude, like, 
Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm, I'm really stuck on this uh, decision here because he had help with his team. Someone helped him with his team. Um, oh god, this guy's being annoying. Um, someone helped him with his team, so I have a feeling he's gonna have hidden power fire and grass just every fucking where, because his team has crazy coverage if you just look at it here. Um, so you can do algae, blah 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 blah. He's got no uh, dragon resist, so let's just bring up uh, Latias. And, um, let's just see what that'll do to Keldeo. Draco Meteor almost kills. If he's wounded, it'll kill. So that's pretty cool. Um, God, I don't know. Like, hmm. I guess I'll just bring what I have. Um, I did change it to bold so he can live, uh, spec secret sword. Alright, he could potentially live a few. Um, let's find Jesus. Alright, what the fuck is his name on here? Uh, oh god. Jesus. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, this is annoying. Are you in the lobby? Can't find your name. <sighs> this Gastrodon does relatively well to most of his team. Um... Just uh, a matter of um, hmm. God, if I can, I don't do this slash user shit. Uh, fuck. Which. <laughs> I did nothing. God fucking damn it. Uh, this is really annoying. Uh, I feel like I'm already in a terrible mood. Um, God. A lot is riding on Ferrothorn and Gastrodon, I feel like. And... This is so annoying, I can't find him. And before he has to leave and we don't battle this week. I'm, I'm, I f I'm feeling it in my bones. This guy's flaking on me really hard. Oh, here he is. Fucking found him. God, stop moving. God. All right. Oh, fuck. I'm just really concerned. Um. <clears throat> God, I'm in, a, I'm in a, a real Gargoflop situation. Um, not to bring him up again like I do every video, but... Uh, <laughs> I made this team like last week because I wanted to battle this guy as soon as possible and of course it didn't fucking happen. I mean if I get a stockpile up this um, Gastrodon will be able to beat the Specs Caldeo so I guess that shouldn't worry me too much. Uh, I calced it in Choice Band uh, for some reason, I'm really uh, convinced he's going to have Reuniclus, so I brought, um, <laughs> I brought fucking Choice Band Skuntank. 
Uh, let's check all the EVs. Last, my first week battle, I had some EVs left over on Electrovire. Uh, which... <laughs> is funny, because it didn't matter for shit. Like, the only thing Electrovire had to do was get that para, and he got it. It wasn't my plan, but it happened that way. Um, yeah, it's all good. Oh, shite. Um, yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let me just look at his team one more time. I don't know why I'm obsessing over this like this. Yeah. Specs, um, Specs Drug Algae could be a problem too. Um, I think at Earthquake, like, pretty much everybody he's got except for Lando T. Um, uh, ex <laughs> fuck, fuck this guy. Okay. He did bring Reuniclus, that's great. He didn't bring Keldeo at all, that's fantastic. I was worried about Keldeo the most, and he's just not fucking there. Um, he versus... what the fuck is his name? Jesus? <sighs> fuck. He doesn't have Zoroark either. I was really worried about Zoroark. Because I don't have a lot of Dark Resist. And this is actually great news. Uh, Tangrowth, though, is going to be a problem. Yeah, Tangrowth is going to be a colossally huge problem. Uh, I don't have Arcanine. And if he has Hidden Power Fire, he beats, like, everybody. <laughs> like, everybody I have. Um... So that's going to be shitty. Uh, here we go. Okay, fun, don't die. God. Well, the Duke's B lead is pretty much out the fucking window here. Um... I'll leave with Sylveon then. <sighs> okay. Alright. Tornadoes. God, this sucks. <laughs> I think he's probably going to U-turn, really. Or knock off. Mmm. Let's, let's just protect. Let's just scout. Let's just see what he's got. So, <laughs> this guy, like, I guess he doesn't have a home computer or something? Like, he has to use his work computer to battle me. That just really irks me, because, like, I, I just feel like there are a million things that could go wrong in that situation. Iron Tail! Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> what a tard. Um, how do you think he's gonna do it again? I'm just gonna guess it on Intoxic something. God! Oh, fuck. Well, Gastrodon, you piece of shit. Iron fucking tail. What the hell? Uh, I don't know if I can even get past this fucking uh, Tornadus. Let's go on to Diggsby here. 
God. I didn't get confused, though. So that's good. Um, I just knock off that thing there. Ah, I think I'm going to lose Diggersby, but... I still have Latias. And Latias is better than Diggersby in this match, but losing Diggersby in turn 4 is fucking awful. Um, but... That life orb just hits so goddamn hard. Huh, yeah, it is a ballsy play. He could have had superpower. Backed in a corner on turn four. Turn four. Okay. Leftovers. Actually, what the fuck am I doing? You're going to Pharaoh right now. And maybe Thunder Wave? <sighs> now, Dugasby is still alive. I don't see this guy having Stealth Rocks on his team at all, so that's going to be fine. Here's Tornadus. Fuck. Ugh. <laughs> this Tornadus is fucking awful, dude. Um... Iron tail, fuck. I should have stayed in. But what can you really do there? Um I'm gonna just death fodder Marisque here. Alright. He's gonna miss. Alright. Miss that hurricane, please. Or maybe randomly switch out thinking I'm gonna make some crazy play just no okay so that's fine oh god let's see let's see uh actually that tornadoes it is T, offensive, life orb. Draco, me oh, okay. So Draco kills now. Good to fucking know. Stay in, please. Please. <laughs> I mean, the way I brought it in is pretty obvious. This guy is pretty fucking good. Oh, what? He lived? What is that shit? Oh, yes! He killed himself with life orb. What a bitch. Alright, that's cool. What the hell was that, though? Oh, that's... I, I fucking calced it wrong, because I'm a fucking retard. Alright, I calced it with a life orb. Mistake number one or two for this match. Alright, Sylveon doesn't give a shit. Like, at all. Gastrodon is gone. Um, but every time he brings in Suicune, I can just... Every time he brings in Suicune or... Um... Uh... <laughs> all I need to do okay all I need to do is get up three spikes and then I can just sweep with Latias basically basically and if he has if his Rotom is choice like it was in his first week's match um then I can definitely kill it um with 
with a fucking um, with a scum tank. So scum tank is actually pretty huge against his team. I think he has he'll probably have poison jab or something stupid, and then I'll live it and then kill him with hyper voice. Interesting choice of move. I knew that fake out was going to be way too obvious. This guy knows his way around a Pokemon. I have to give him credit. Um, he's he's old enough to know what he's doing. He's 19. He has a real job. He has he probably has a real brain. Oh, uh, Reuniclus. Oh, Reuniclus. Oh. Oh, Reuniclus. I got Skuntank, though. This this could be tough though, cause he's mm, I don't know, I don't know. He's 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 got leftovers on his Reuniclus. He definitely has a uh, a calm minding one, I think. So uh, Scum Tank is going to be huge here, unless he doubles out. Yeah, um, he doubles out again. This guy is uh, really very competent. Um, I'm actually going to stay in just to see if he... Okay, he did not go Hidden Power Fire. Oh, I lost my Choice Band, though. That kind of sucks. All right. He is fucking weird. Haha, -ha, fun. Okay, so he does have hidden power. Um, I'm actually going to do a wish baton pass to Ferrothorn here. I'm going to try. His um, Tornadus' T is gone, so that is a huge weight off my mind here. I'm just gonna knock off everything. That's kind of fine. That is also kind of fine. But yeah, I was worried about hidden power fire, and sure, sure enough, he's got it. Um, definitely ballsy play switching Dugusby in on Tornado's T. You could have superpowered me, but I was convinced he was not gonna use superpower, and I was actually right about that. But that was a real shot in the dark. <laughs> like there was no guarantee for that. But, uh, because I lost my choice band, um, uh, Scum Tank still can beat Reuniclus. <coughs> Excuse me. I think he might be Assault Vest, because he's, he has all attacks, and he hasn't used, uh, he hasn't, um, used his leftovers yet. I think he's uh, feeling kind of down about his position, which, you know, that's fair. Um, man, Ferthorn really took that uh, Hidden Power Fire beautifully. Oh, I don't even. I think I, I think I have Power Whip on Ferthorn. Paralyzed. Okay. Uh, let's... God, if he's... Oh, I have voice. Hidden Power Fire? Nope, okay. I think he's just letting it go down. I'm not sure I'm okay with, for sure. Hidden Power Fire 2. How much did that do? 33? Oh, this is Calm Mind. Okay. Let's Wish and Baton Pass here. This could get this could get fucky, actually. 
All right. Actually, there's no real reason to put on pass right now. So we did bring a Crocoon, which I was concerned about. Um, but I'm not really concerned about it right now, because I got Ferrothorn, and I can just kill him with Power Whip. Uh, this, uh, this recording brought to you by Monster Energy Drink. Please, in the comments, tell me all of the bad things Monster Energy Drink is going to do into my body. <sighs> Spikes. Alright, let's get that power whip out. I would like it if Ferrothorn did more damage to Suikun. But that is not going to happen. <laughs> that is simply not going to happen. Um, I did knock off his leftovers though, so that's that's nice. Mustn't forget that. Alright. Stay in for another spikes. I'm going to watch as he doesn't use hidden power fire or gets fully paralyzed. Oh. Okay, he did it, but I'm okay with that. Um, actually, yeah, I think I kill with Hyper Voice because of the spikes if he wants to bring his Suicune in. Uh, so let's do that. Life Storm, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah! I'm not sure if that crit mattered. Let's see. He'll probably say it did, but let's see how much it did before on uh, Sylveon. 21% before, but they had to call mind up. Uh, he's not going to be happy about that one, but I really thought it was going to kill either way. Not sure if crit mattered. Was spikes. Um, but maybe. Z. Okay. Well, things are looking in my favor. Um, Pretty heavily due to Hex, possibly. I feel... I feel bad, like... I honestly do feel bad, but I don't at the same time, because I want to win by all means necessary. If I crit all of his Pokémon, like super mega death crits, and they all just go down, I'll, I'll happily take that. Um, but I do definitely favor close matches. And Sylveon just fucking bones him. Like, Tangrowth can't, uh, really do anything. He's probably gonna go to Rotom.
Hmm. The real question is, pretty much the only thing I need to know is what the hell is Rotom is, and it's not really a, a huge concern for me because Rotom is pretty weak in the grand scheme of things, and we'll probably go down to a Draco at, at you know, full. It'd be good to get up Stealth Rocks, though, just to have. In fact, I should have gone for Stealth Rocks instead of a second layer. Okay, here comes Rotom. Let's see what we got. Alright, he's got Will-O-Wisp. Now we know. Now we know what we're dealing with here. And, uh, honestly, best play is Ferrothorn? Yeah, really. Because if he's got Will-O-Wisp, he surely does not... Yeah. <laughs> Hi, guys. Yeah. Ferrothorn pretty much isn't needed right now. Like, is. Yeah. We'll switch. Okay. Oh, his life orb. Now, Reuniclus. I have a scun tank. I'm not too concerned about what you have. Calm mind, huh? Um, we got Crunch. I ever think I've already shown him Crunch. Maybe a Pursuit. That'd be nice. Let's just try the old pursuit. He's sitting in there, he's thinking, he's probably switching. In fact, most of what he's done this match is switch. But I mean, he's been switching really beautifully, really masterfully, uh, doubling out to tornadoes like that very early on. Uh, put an insane amount of pressure on my team. As he either stays in predicting the pursuit and then I kill him with crunch. Uh because I can switch up my moves now. Alright, he's gonna do that. Yeah, I'm not even sure if I can kill him any uh kill him with it anymore. Mmm. Pretty sure. Oh god. Defense drop? I'm just gonna crit you, dude. And if you switch out, that's just more free damage. So I have no reason to pursue it, really. Diggsby kind of fucks up, um, <laughs> or not Diggsby, uh, Rotom kind of fucks up Diggsby, uh, because I certainly can't knock off, uh, let's just, Death Fodder Pharaoh, I don't think he gets any priority. Does he? God. 
<laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, man. Brain, come on, let's go. Let's go, brain. Uh, the only priority he gets is... Yeah, he, he really doesn't at all, so... That is fine. Oh, I could healing wish, too, because be, that would be funny, but uh, also a waste of time. Psy shock for sure. Just to be safe. Just to be safe here. Does he get quick attack? Fuck, he might get quick attack. Oh god. I really hope he doesn't have like power up punch power up punch quick attack or something stupid like that. Is the slow punny actually a threat? It could be. God, I'm on pins and needles here. How long is this taking? Okay. Uh, just take your turn, uh, please. Okay. Another crit. No, that crit really didn't matter. Like, at all. But we could pretend it matters if you want. Rotom. You silly little bitch. I'm not gonna... Mm. Oh my god. Uh, is he just gonna fucking will o me? Or is he gonna go for the Shadow Ball? Kinda wanna... Get out. Yeah. Yeah, we're going for it. Go Shadow Ball, please. Ah! <laughs> ah, that's funny. Dido knockoff. <laughs> yes, I have two Scarfers. Why are you doing that, huh? He lives. <sighs> Sylveon, preserve the win or the point pointage for me here. <sighs> All right. Sylveon really putting in an insane amount of work. Ah, fuck. Why, did, why didn't I go fucking... <gasps> Protect on high jump kick. Oh my god. Are we gonna do this? We're gonna do this. No, he won't return. Okay. That makes sense. That's too bad. So I'm I'm gone, but I have um, Scarf Latias, who's gonna take the win for me here. Scarf Latias. Wow. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was crazy. Hazards didn't uh, really come into play as much as I thought they would. About Scarf Latias. I knew I needed him, and. <coughs> Boy, howdy, was I right. <coughs> Fuck. It's just as close as. as pretty. It's not as close as the first match I had. This is a 2-0. -oh. 
but still fucking close. Man, he he played really, really. I don't know. Uh, he's down on himself, but yeah, there was some min max, or he didn't click the right move, which you can't blame hacks for that. Um, God, Latias just really put in all the moves. Thanks, Latias. <laughs> okay, that, this is going to be the conclusion of the uh, Week 2 battle for Pika League Season 2. I hope you enjoyed it. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you later, YouTube.